everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is India and today we are going to be doing the booktube darling tag. Um, I got tagged in this by AJ McDonald. Um, I'll be talking about his channel or their channel, their channel more later. Um, but thank you for tagging me. Um, which, you know, it's rare to get tagged in things. Normally just do it to do it. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Um, but anyway, so let's get started with this book tag. I actually did my research ahead of time for this one because the whole purpose of the tag um, was to shout out booktubers. Um, this tag was created by, hold on, hold on, it's coming up, was created by April from Getting Hoogie With It. Um, I will tag that video below as well. I was also tagged AJ McDonald's channel video below as well. Um, but anyway, so, Let's start out. Booktube Darling Tag. So number one, White Rabbit. Which booktuber introduced you to the wonderful land of booktube? Um, I can't say that any particular booktuber introduced me to booktube. Um, because, um, so yeah, I can't say that any, um, particular booktuber introduced me to the land of booktube. Um, years ago when I was in college, I started uploading videos to YouTube and then, I was busy, I didn't continue, I, you know, like, closed the channel, did all this stuff, and now I've revisited it again. Um, it was really being on Instagram and finding Bookstagram, which I think I, like, the first true, like, Bookstagram account I found was, um, Sing Pretty Read Books, um, on Instagram. Um, and that kind of brought me back truly in-depth with the world of books on the internet. So yeah. Um, two, underrated. Which booktuber should have loads more subscribers? Okay, y'all, there are tons of booktubers who should have loads more subscribers, in my opinion, but I'm only gonna shout out two right now. Um, first one is AJ McDonald, who tagged me in this. They are freaking hilarious, okay? And the whole channel concept is so cool. The whole thing is animated. Like, it's not like a person talking to a camera. It's this whole animation with voiceover, and it's so cool. I'm like, damn, like, that takes some work. Like, that takes some serious work. And he, they bring out, like, fantastic content and with a lot of discussion and a lot of opinions. And I just, I've been falling in love with their channel. Like, truly have been. So just go check them out. Tag below. Um, oh, and um, Desiree over at Libri Labra, um, I love her. She's been on here for, I'm pretty sure, about as long as I've been on BookTube, too. And she should have loads more subscribers. She puts out consistent content, um, good content, and um, sometimes creative content, and, like, like true, like, DIY stuff. And I love that. Sorry, my hair bothers me sometimes um, when it's not perfect, and, um, which it never is. Um, but they also have a channel that I think should have tons more subscribers for how much work that she does on the internet, um, for her YouTube, Twitter, and Bookstagram, so go check her out. Yeah. Um, AutoWatch. Which, number three is AutoWatch. Which booktuber do you drop everything to watch the minute their video goes live? Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I don't watch nobody's video the minute it drops. I just don't, um, mainly because, like, I don't like notifications. I don't like YouTube notifications. There's very few YouTubers that I have a notification, and really, I just keep forgetting to take them off because I don't like, I don't like getting notifications. I just don't. And so, most of the time, I just check my subscription feed and see when my subscription feed is coming up, um, and who's on there. Um, but if I truly had to pick, um, I'm gonna kind of change the question a little bit and I'm gonna go with discussion videos um, that I will drop everything what I'm doing and to watch their discussion videos and that's gonna be Laura over at the novel Lush and Sam from Thoughts on Tomes. If they're doing a discussion video about like a hot topic in the booktube world like I'm watching it because most of the time I'm over here like yes 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 like everything you say is so true and I relate I relate and thank you for your candidness and Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. So, definitely two that I love. Two that I absolutely love for that. Um, it's winning. 
is number four. <laughs> Sorry. Is number four. It says, which booktuber has the most similar reading tastes to you? You know, recently my reading tastes have changed a lot. So if I go with my original reading tastes, I would have to say probably Jashana and Brandy. Um, I'm pretty sure Jashana's channel is just Jashana or Jashana Reads maybe. And then Brandy at Brandy Reads or Brandy Books. You know, I will be tagging them below as well. Um, yeah, it's just Shoshana. Her tag name is Shoshana. Shoshana C. Um, whose channel is taking off because she does an amazing job. And then Brandy over at Brandy's Books. Um, yeah, she should also have more subscribers too. Um, to, um, to go with the number two. Brandy, Brandy's Books should also have more subscribers. Um, love her. Um, but I think we have the most similar taste books. Um, you know, especially if I'm thinking like fantasy with a hint of contemporary in there. Um, I would have to go with that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Number five, Boss Beast Mode. Um, which booktuber do you look up to or admire the most? Um, I would probably, I go with Stephanie at Romance Book Talk. I admire her the most because she works so hard. Like, she puts out almost daily video, guys. Like, if she isn't putting out a daily video, then she's definitely putting out a weekly video. And then speaking of people who p put out a weekly video that just, like, popped to my head, um, Kathy, Kathy Trank, I'm probably not going to say her name right. Um, Stephanie, just because she, um... She's kind of amazing, and she puts out videos all the time. Not only that, she works super hard at um, getting the romance genre just, like, more and more love on the internet base. We all know it's highly read in the grander scheme of the book world, but in the internet for BookTube and Instagram, um, um, she definitely works really hard on that, and... Also in um, on Instagram and stuff. Not only that, she works really hard with working with publishers and authors and stuff to read their books and reviews. She does reviews like that, and she she's just she's a powerhouse. She's a beast. And why can't I find Kathy's channel? Yeah, Kathy Tr Trithart. Kathy Trithart. Um, she also works really hard on YouTube. She's also putting out weekly content at a minimum. Um, I can barely put out monthly content, so she's definitely one to check out and look for because um, she is a beast and she reads such a wide variety of books that like if you need something, you know, she can definitely get you there. Most definitely. Um, six, Bestie. Which booktuber are you generally friends with or which booktuber could you see yourself being friends with in real life? So this is like really awkward because it's like if I feel like we're friends but you don't feel like we're friends then are we friends? Like am I just putting myself out there? But anyway I'm going to say that these people I am friends with. I'm claiming it. I'm claiming you. So when I see you guys at Book Net Fest, you guys better act like you're my friends. Okay? Okay. Um, so first off is Stephanie. I don't know if she's coming to Book Net Fest. She should. But Stephanie from Romance Book Talk. I, I love her. I love you. It's okay. Um, Lauren from the novel Lush. I would love to be friends with her. We're not already friends. Um, I would love to be friends with you. I feel like we get along just fine. Brandy. Met her at BookNet Fest last year. Love her ever since. Um, Jashana. I feel like we would be best friends. If we're not, I'm claiming it. Um, Desiree from Libby, Libby Labra met her at BookNet Fest last year, but we were already becoming friends before BookNet Fest, and then we met in person, and then I still loved her, and now she needs to love me back, okay? Um, and I would definitely want to be friends with Noria from Noria Reads. Um, we haven't fostered a relationship yet, but we'll get there. We'll get there. Um, seven, Bookcase Envy. Which booktuber has a library you love to have? Either the books on their shelves or their library setup itself. Um, Marinez from My Name is Marinez. Um, y'all, if you guys haven't seen her videos, which you definitely should see her videos, um, but I love her bookcases behind her. It's so bright and colorful, and I'm just like, those are so awesome. What are those? What version is that? I don't know, but they're awesome like 
truly awesome. Love them. Um, Mexican action, which booktuber hasn't posted in a while that you miss immensely? Um, I'm not gonna lie, I don't watch enough YouTube these days to miss people. Okay, you know what? That's not true. That's not true. Uh, my booktube watching has grown immensely. So if you, if I was doing this a few months from now and somebody went missing, I'd definitely be like, hey, what's up? How you doing? Where you at? You okay? Um, but someone I did notice who I used to watch a lot that went missing for a little bit was Anisha from Sprinkled Pages. Um, she has great content um, as well. I also love her bookshelves. They're really pretty. Um, and she also has great content. Um, nine is the newbie. Which booktube newbie are you most excited about? Um, ten, tin, like, like tin, like metal tin, um, minute book reviews. Um, I will tag their channel down below. They are a sister duo, I believe, and they are new to the booktube scene and they do book reviews and other vlogs and things like that. And they're really awesome and I cannot wait to see how their channel grows and what they're doing. Um, so that's who I'm really excited about. Um, tag three people. Shit, I didn't look this up. Um, well, if I talked about you in this video and you haven't done it, then I tag you. And then I'll tag some more on Twitter. Because Twitter, I'm better at it on Twitter. So yeah. Also those who I said we should be friends, we should be friends. Slide it to my messages. Or mention me on Twitter. Or Instagram. Okay, um, but that is it for this. I will try and tag all of these channels down below so you can go check them out and become friends with them. Don't forget to hit like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Follow me on all the social media so you can see how awkward I am at becoming friends with people on Twitter and Instagram and all that good stuff. And that is it. So let me know what you think of these people or any people I should follow and subscribe to that you think I should definitely do. Um, let me know if you are one of those. Let me know. Be like, hey, I got a channel. <laughs> Check it out. No shame in my game. Um, so definitely let me know. And until next time, keep turning the pages. <laughs>